Good morning, General Nash. It's that Faculty Friday show. I am joined by fifth grade teacher, Miss Tulu. Good morning, Miss Tulu. Good morning. I hear we have something special today. Yes. Did you know, Mr. Coulter, that on September 17th, it is Constitution Day in honor of our country's Constitution. So fifth graders in my homeroom are going to start you off by saying the preamble. And all you sixth graders should remember this from last year. We the people of the United States, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity. To ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States of America. Wow, everybody, I want to hear clapping all over the school. That was fantastic, fifth grade. You're all my favorites. Awesome. Well, let's continue with the mash. I know you just sat down, fifth grade, but guess what? Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. Wow. Fifth grade, you are crushing it today on a Friday. I hope your parents take you out for pizza and ice cream and let you have sleepovers this weekend. All right. Miss Tulu, what's for lunch today? All right. So here's our lunch menu for today. Wedge pizza, hot dog, oh, sorry, hot dog, excuse me, hot dog on a WG bun. WG means whole grain. Assorted entree packs with tossed garden salad, fruit cup, and milk. That sounds delicious. All right, fun fact, September is a popular month for weddings. I should know my anniversary was two days ago. Go ahead. You can get with this. Phillies win versus an Eagles win. Raise your hand if you like a Phillies win. Now raise your hand if you like an Eagles fan. win. And they won last night! Yeah. Wow, you guys are awesome at that. All right, here's the joke of the day. What did the detective in the Arctic say to the suspect? First he said, boo to the Giants. And then he said, uh, where, where were you on the night of September to March? Because in Antarctica, it can be nighttime for up to three months at a time. Three months of night. That's crazy. Miss Salu, what's our riddle? Riddle me this. What asks but never answers? An owl that says, ooh. I don't know who. The owl. Who? The owl. Who? Who? All right. Nash News, today is Friday, September 15th. It is a day four. Put your first and last name on your blue tickets. When I look for the PBAIS winners, I'm seeing the office has a lot of first names. First and last name, please. Uh, and come to the office after special or I believe during lunch. Was uh, We just got an update on that. Tomorrow, Saturday, September 16th, is the sixth grade car wash at McDonald's. Da, 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 da. By the Weiss in the North Penn High School from 10 to 2 p.m. Chorus starts. If you're in fourth, fifth, or sixth grade, go down to Mrs. Widener's room, get a permission slip, have to fill it out, bring it back, and be part of the chorus. They do all sorts of fun stuff. I know they one time they sang at a Sixers game, and they sing at the Christmas thing over in Fisher's Park that we all go to. Awesome job. Buses, we are on a lookout for older students, helping to make sure younger kids line up correctly, do a good job, and you might be pictured. And safety tip, equipment should be held tightly when leaving the building. Balls should not be tossed or bounced. If they accidentally roll into the street, little kids might go after it without thinking, putting themselves in danger. Do you know I actually had to tell a student not to throw it coming into the building? I didn't think I need to say that after this has been on the mash, but I'll have to amend it over the weekend to say don't do it on your way in or on your way out. I thought that 
that was self-explanatory, but silly me for assuming that. Well, you know, and coming in, it's also being respectful to the classes that you are learning, Absolutely. that are learning. You're right, Ms. Hill. Right. Oh, you didn't know. Happy Hispanic Heritage Month. Lynn manuel Miranda is an American songwriter, actor, filmmaker, and playwright. He is known for creating the Broadway musicals In the Heights and Hamilton, and the soundtrack for the animated films Moana, Vivo, and Encanto. I've seen Hamilton. I've seen Encanto. I've seen Moana. They're phenomenal. This guy's pretty legit. He is. That's so Nash, our PBIS winners. Take a look at the screen. We've got Tyler, Nathaniel, Jack, John, Dawson, Cheyenne, and Lexi, who is sitting in front of me. All right. Thank you for not going bananas fifth grade. We got a good job. I'm well behaved. All right. Words to live by. If you play silly games, you're going to win silly prizes in life. That's not good. Happy Rosh Hashanah and have a great weekend, Ms. Tulu. Have too, a great Mr. weekend, Coulter. fifth grade. Have a great weekend, Nash. Bye now.